Did lions live in Sri Lanka? As the second largest member of the cat family, lions were once scattered worldwide. Currently, two subspecies of lions exist. The African lions of sub-Saharan Africa and the Asiatic lions of India. It's estimated that around 20,000 African lions live in the wild, while Asiatic lions number around 500. Although fossil records were found in parts of the Indian subcontinent, there is scarce evidence of lions in Peninsula India or Sri Lanka. However, in 1936, several teeth were discovered in the Ratnapura district, supposedly belonging to a lion. The discovery was made by celebrated archaeologist P.E.P. Deraniagala, who claimed it belonged to a lion species endemic to Sri Lanka. He compared the fossil to that of two lions at the British Museum and concluded that the Ceylon fossil, although narrower and more elongate, agreed in general size with the lion's teeth. Hence the species was dubbed Panthera leo sinhalius, or Ceylon lion. But there's scant evidence to prove that this species differed from other lions. Deraniagala further stated that though lions are now restricted to the Gir forest in India, they once roamed the entire subcontinent and formed part of the fauna isolated in Ceylon. One would assume that with countless references to lions in Sri Lankan culture that they may have once existed on the island. For instance, the Sinharaja Forest Reserve in Sri Lanka, situated in the same province where the lion teeth were found, was thought to be the last refuge of a legendary lion. Yet the fossil evidence suggests that lions existed before human civilization in the country, becoming extinct around 40,000 years ago. Therefore, the highly stylized lions seen in ancient architecture were probably a figment of the artist's imagination. During the Pleistocene period, the northern hemisphere of our planet was virtually covered with glaciers, resulting in a cold climate. This caused a lower main sea level than today. In turn, it gave way to a land bridge that connected Sri Lanka with mainland India. During the period, many large and small animals crossed over to Sri Lanka. So, did lions make the crossing too? But if the lion disappeared before human civilization, how did it become so prominent in Sri Lankan symbology? One theory is that Prince Vijaya, the first king of Sri Lanka, who came from India in 486 BCE, had a lion flag upon arrival. Since then, the lion featured heavily in Sri Lankan culture. Another theory is that when King Dutagemanu went to war with King Elara, he had a banner with a sword-bearing lion which is one of the oldest references to the lion flag. In 1948, when the island gained independence from colonial rule, the lion flag became the national flag of Sri Lanka. If lions did live in Sri Lanka during a certain period, how did they go extinct? Experts believe that climate change and loss of habitat may have played a part. The pluvial phase, causing high rainfall, saw the growth of rainforests and dense monsoon forests, which weren't friendly habitats for lions, who preferred drier habitats, like open grasslands. But apart from Dera Niagala's claim of lion teeth in the 1930s, there is no other evidence to verify the prehistoric existence of lions in Sri Lanka. <laughs>